Have you heard of the Moors? No? What if I told you that they are responsible for making Europe and America what they are today? That they don't want you to know that. See, the Moors ruled most of the Iberian Peninsula for the 8th century, and they brought things like mathematics, sciences, architecture, agriculture, art, science, basically everything that we consider modern day Europe. But shh. That's supposed to be a secret. They are actually the ones that are responsible for bringing Europe out of the Dark Ages and into the Renaissance. But again, you're not supposed to know that. Meanwhile, while the Christian Europe had an illiteracy rate of 99% and zero universities and zero libraries, Moors, they had 17. 17 universities in seven cities and over 70 libraries. And then they introduced their education system to Europe. There was a man called Zuryab. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but he was a Moor. And he actually pioneered changing clothes based on the season. That's how dumb Europeans were at the time. They didn't even... What? They also invented deodorant, daily bathing, and invented toothpaste. Like, no wonder the Black Plague destroyed Europe. They were filthy. Zuryab also introduced a three-course meal. Soup, main course, dessert, and the Moors, they even introduced crops that are still prominent in Spain today. Moorish cities also had streetlights, hospitals, and running water and streetlights and paved streets weren't even introduced in London and Paris for another couple hundred years. Moors are also the ones that built the aqueducts that brought running water from the mountains down to the cities, which gave Europe running water. The father of modern surgery was also a Moor, named Al-Zarawi. Don't know if